what's up? My name is Technoba here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another Valheim video. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to install the popular modding platform BebNX for Valheim. Basically, this is a prerequisite, meaning something that's required for a lot of mods to be installed and work with Valheim. A lot of the mods nowadays do come with this packaged up in the same zip, so all you have to do is drag and drop it across into your game folder and things work fine. But assuming a mod says it requires BepinX and it hasn't got it included with it, what exactly do we need to do? Well, of course, BepinX itself doesn't actually add any mods, it just allows you to install plugins, etc., and it will automatically load them in certain Unity games, including Valheim. So, what exactly do we need to do to install BepinX for Valheim? Well, it's super simple. To install it on client side, simply open up Steam and then navigate Valheim on the list. Right click it, hover over manage and click browse local files. Then once the game folder opens up, you'll see something similar to this. All we have to do is head across to BepinX's GitHub page, which will be linked down below. You'll find this page over here. When you get to this page, you'll be able to scroll through, read some info on what sort of Unity games it supports, and a couple of other things, but what we're really interested in here is the Releases tab in the top right-hand corner, right over here. Simply click the Releases name at the very top, and we'll see a list of releases here. What we need to do is scroll up to the top of this list and look for the one with the latest release tag. Then simply click on the Unix version, Windows 64 and Windows 32-bit version. Download the one that matches your setup. I'm downloading the Windows 64-bit setup and I'll simply open up the zip when it's done downloading. Then put the zip across to the side, put your game folder across to the side, move everything out of the zip into your game folder and congratulations, you've now successfully installed BepinX for Valheim. How exactly do we install it for a dedicated server? Well, it's pretty simple. All you have to do is basically the exact same steps, though if you're running a different operating system, do keep that in mind. I have a Valheim server installed in Steam, so I'll simply search for it at the very top, but of course it doesn't matter where you got it from. I'll right-click it, manage, and browse local files to get to the folder with all of the files for my server in it. I might already have BepinX installed here, which I do, but once again, all you need to do is open up the zip that you downloaded, put it across to the side, put your server folder across to the side, and drag everything across from the zip into your game server folder. After placing it in as such, it's now installed and BepinX will be working on your server the next time it's fired up. Of course, this doesn't actually add anything to the game, but it allows you to install other mods. To do this, you'd usually find a plugins folder in the BepinX folder. But of course, it's not there currently. All we have to do is launch up the game at least once and a plugins folder will generate. Now, all I'll do is close out of Valheim and check the BepinX folder once again. This time, you'll now see a couple new files here. Config, which is where plugin configs will go once it's been loaded up at least once after installing plugins. And the plugins folder is over here where we simply drop the plugin files for it to work. So after you drop a plugin DLL or whatever in here and start up your server or game, you'll see a new config appear in the config folder. You can go ahead and edit the plugin's config and after another restart or reloading the plugin, your new settings should be applied in the plugin for either your client or server, depending where you install the plugin to. It's super simple and it's a really nice modding platform. I really do like it and it's pretty simple, it just works. But anyways, that's about it for this video. If you'd like to know how to install other mods for Valheim or other Valheim general tips, make sure to check the description down below as you might find something that catches your interest. My name is Vintech Number here for Troubleshoot and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.